Hello everyone, I'm D-Mind, the mind of one and all, and welcome back to another episode, and perhaps the last episode of Eternal Senior. Or maybe not the last episode, because there are multiple endings, and I might try to get the multiple endings. Oh well. So, I've already got all the legendary tier for the this third, the last level I think. I think this is the last level, yeah. And I think I should complete all the quests here, alright. Yeah. Nice book of invasion. You have completed all the quests. Oh wait, that's not like shit. Thanks for your help. Wait. How did I do slimy voice again? Thanks for your help. As a token of appreciation, here's an extra gift. No, that sounds like I messed up their voices. With art studying on the of the book of the vision books, you can be as good as I am. Reading is power. Yeah. Alright. Hmm. Okay, I have for the legendary tier. Let's write you all geared up with legendary items. Here is your gift as promised. Alright. Bah! You sh Wait, bah! You should now be invincible with legendary gears. And Jack. 606. Gah, gah. You have found all the chests. As promised, here is your gift. Yep. I missed one violet crystal, god dang it. Oh well. I'll just make... Let me see. No wait, it should... Where is it? Ah, violet crystal armor. Yep, I'll make that. Ooh. That. Hmm. Hmm. Then I want a healing ribbon, perhaps? Okay. Is that all though? I think that's all. I actually can't use the book anymore because I reached the max. Huh. Alright. So that's it. Save. Um, yeah, here. Okay, let's go forth. Beyond this door is the point of no return. Yep. Onward. Oh, wait, you hit me already? I just entered the room and you hit me. Sis Magalata. I've been expecting you. Huh? Come. Uh, I've taken full command of eternity. There's nothing to worry about anymore. Really, you don't look like it. You look, you look, you look more like eternity taken over you. Just a bit more. We can stay together forever. With the help of eternity. Mm. There is something I must tell Sis Magaleta. I will regret the rest of my life if I do not pass my real thoughts to Sis Magaleta. I have always thought that Sis never correctly recognized me. I thought I am just near to you, not Senya, not who I am. With that bear in mind, Sis. No, with that, bear in mind, sis, you are such a distant figure. I felt that I am in no place to speak to you. There's so much I would love to tell you. But I cannot, because I am not near. Huh? Was my attitude so misleading? Wait, she came back? Huh? She's regained her consciousness. And she's not. Ugh. Sis Magleta. No, I have not been looking at you as a replacement of Nia. You worry too much. So come, join me and live together forever. No. Hmm? As your little sister, I will stop you. Stop me? For what? I will free you from eternity and return to our church together. I'm afraid that is beyond your power. That may be true, but all hope will be lost if I do not try. Really? It's not like the end of the world. Oh well. Try your best then. Oh, Margaretha, we have to fight her now. Oh! You dodge it! Oh! Oh! You miss. I mean, not miss, you disappear. I do not want to stand there. I think. Hey! That hit it. Okay. 
Alright, it's okay, let's skip that. Alright, cool. I was about to say, that's cheating, but then I realized I could break it, then I'm like, alright, it's not. Oh! You're invincible on two. Ooh. No. And not that hard, though I would assume this isn't even your final form, am I right? Or maybe I have to fight eternally after this. Because they're really not that difficult. Oh. Yes, so. You are so offensive now. Oh, so close. Come on, die already. Right. Phew. Phew. It is my victory. Sis, I am no longer the little girl that needs your protection. Now, I have the strength to protect you. I may be worrying too much. But I do not like the fact that Sis is burdening, burdening all the responsibilities alone. I am Senya, your sister Senya. You are not alone, Sis Magleta. So please let me share the burden with you. You can share anything, everything with me. Senya? Oh, she's back to normal? You have matured a lot. You may be right. I may have made a huge mistake. However, it would not matter if I regret now. It is all too late. Huh? I can no longer leave the Tower of Eternity. Huh? This is the price for using the Power of Eternity. What? No! No! There must be some other way. I could absorb Eternity. That's my power, right? The Fairy Queen told me. Sis? Uh, uh, what is this? Why don't we stay in the Tower of Eternity forever? Uh-oh. Huh? No! No! Oh! Ah! Uh, we can stick together without leaving this place. Isn't this great, Senya? Yes, Sis Magaleta. What? Oh, come on. You have to break free from this, right? Sis will protect you from anything. Wait, what? Don't, that can't be the end, right? Ending 1. Eternal Senior. What? Wait, so that's the first ending? Hint for other ending loops. You may have passed areas in Fallen Sanctum. Um, actually I did not. I'm pretty sure. Go back from the confessional hall and there is a magic circle that can walk you to another area. Which contains the key accessory to access... To access ending 2 and 3. Don't forget to have... To have the accessory equipped during the final battle. Please try to make it to ending 2 and 3, holy priest. What? So I have to equip it? Ah, no wonder. I'm like, no, that's, that can't be. Alright. Ah, I see. Alright. Okay, cross pen. Onward! Alright, this time. This time I will get the other ending. But, what the... Yeah, I get hit the first time I just enter here. Alright, but what determines ending 2 and 3? Do I get a choice or something? Says Magaleta. I've been expecting you. Come. Alright, same thing. Yeah, let's skip all this. Control does not skip, right? Yup. This is not a visual novel. Alright. 
I have the... Alright. I do have the... Yep, I have the cost pending equip just to make sure. Yeah. Oof. Well, you're gonna do that. I can't hit you. Oh. Oh. I did not expect that. Oh, you teleport. Come back here. Where you go? You're gonna teleport me. I can't hit you now. All right. Ugh. Alright, we got her. I got the cross pending equip. Yo, let's see what happens. Phew, phew. It is my victory. Sis, I'm no longer. Yep. Huh. Alright, let's see how this changed the ending. Okay. Yes. Uh, uh, what is this? Why don't we stay in the Tower of Eternity forever? Huh? No. No! Yes, the pendant worked! Huh? The cross pendant is glowing. Isn't that Nia's pendant? The pendant I gave to Senya to weaken the curse. It resists eternity as well? Uh, the power of eternity is losing control. Ow, Senya, stay away! Huh? Ah, she's Magaletta! Final boss battle! Huh? Is this caused by eternity? Is that eternity herself there? Like the time when Fairy Queen Malphi lost control? So perhaps I can. Or is that our sister Magaletta? I can't tell. Hmm. Sis. This may hurt a little. I will save you. Oh. Alright. Um. Eternal Magaletta. If she's a toner, how do I kill her? Oops. Ah, sticky keys. Damn you. Oh. Get out. Oh. Huh. Whoa. Wait, how? Oh, I see. I thought I was standing in the middle there. Oh. Oh god. Uh, am I gonna die? Oh wait. These nuns do nothing to me. Like, literally no damage. Can't tell what is. Oh god, this hectic. Get out of there! Get out of everywhere! This is. Oh. 
Wait, 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 wait. Hold up. Oh. I think I need to change the cross pendant to the healing ribbon. I'm sorry, sis Magaletta. No! No! That's not how it's supposed to go. Alright. Rematch! Okay, quick up. Quickly from the beginning. Eternal Ribbon. Um. I like how in the beginning they show you, they kind of teach you this, so you know what to do. Oh. Kind of hard to tell the hit detection on that laser. Well, the priests do no- the nuns do no damage. Yep, see? No damage. They are non threats Hold on, how am I supposed to escape that? That's... This is cheating! Oh. I missed. No, wait. I need to kill her. Yes. But I'm not equipping the pendant anymore. Should I equip? Does that determine the different ending? I don't know. Alright, kill her. Um. Let's see if it touch slot. Okay. I... Sis Magaletta, are you okay? Senya. Eh? It's nice to have you back, really. I thought I would lose you forever. Magaletta carefully embraces Senya with a peaceful smile. Sorry for making you worry. Sis Magaletta... I'm right here, right next to you. Why? Why did you leave me without word? Why left me alone? How can you do this to me? I'm sorry. You can count on me too. Wait, you can count on me too. Don't try to burden everything by yourself. Share with me, okay? You're right. I've done it wrong this time. Sorry for making you went through all this. I must have hurt you bad. It is the real sis this time, right? Yep. Not some illusion by demons, right? <laughs> of course not. Nor isn't this a dream? Not a dream either. I'm right here for you. Magalata hugs Senya even harder, touching her cheek to Senya's hair. Slowly and carefully, it's like this moment is a water bubble which will burst with just a tiny bit of force. I've returned, Senya. Senya raises her head, staring straight at Magaletta's face. It's like she cannot make sure if this is true or not. Magaletta looks back at Senya with a warm smile, and shows Senya this is all real. Seeing so, Senya jumps right back into Magaletta's heart. Welcome back, sis Magaletta. I thought I was the one who entered the Tower of Eternity for your life. I thought it was worth the price, even if that means I can never see you again. I thought I was determined, but now, I have proven myself wrong. It's so nice to be able to see you again. Sis Magaletta. However, this does not mean I forgive you for risking into the Tower of Eternity. Eh? But, I... Um... Do you know what is at risk for venturing into the Tower of Eternity? Oh. What? I... Do you know how worried I was when you 
were cursed because you followed me. I blame myself for not being able to lift you from the curse so bad. I'm sorry, sis. Am I being too harsh on her? Anyway, nothing is better than seeing you all safe and sound. Sis Margaleta. Margaleta hugs, tightly hugs Xenia again. It is almost like she's making sure existence is real. A deep, deep hug lasted almost a century. So they hug for 100 years. It's real. Sis, let's go home together. I've met, I've met Malfit, the fairy queen on my way here. She may have some clue in lifting your curse. A fairy queen? Sure, let's go. Right. I'll lead the way. Okay. Oh? Ah. Senya, what is wrong? Oh no, I didn't equip the... The pendant again. Eternity. Sis. Ah, uh, shock. Wait, that... I shouldn't say shock. Senya. Ah. Uh. It's no use. What should I do now? What can I do to save Xenia? I cannot afford to wait. What will happen to Xenia if I don't act quick? Suddenly a bad feeling rises in my mind. I cannot bear to imagine losing Xenia. The desperation is like a swamp that sucked me in. What should I do now? Is there a way, any way to save her? Xenia. I have to save Xenia. I cannot just sit and watch her. Xenia may be taken away any time now. No. It's not the time to give up hope. I should focus on saving Senya. There is one method. I'm sorry, Senya. It is okay, sis. I am fine. This will not last too long. It will stop in a bit, Senya. So, sis, do not, do not come over. I'm sorry, Senya. It looks like I will not be able to keep my promise. Sis, what is she trying to do? What? Should I do? Are you gonna give me a choice? So we could push Magaleta away or do nothing. Oh, so this determines the ending. Huh. Well, I'm gonna do both. So for now, let's just... Um... Uh, do nothing. Cause I want to push her away, so I'll do the... One that I don't want to do first. The pain is gone. What happened? She bur she she bet the curse. Huh? Sis, stop! You cannot take any more eternity. Sis Magleta. Yes, what are you doing? Open the door! Sis Magaleta! Sen... Senya... Huh? Sis! I'm sorry... Sis... Why are you apologizing? It seems like we cannot go back to our church together. Huh? There must be some other way. Don't give up now. I'm sorry. No, stop saying sorry. Come back to me, sis. Senya, listen. No, no, just open the door first. I'll listen to whatever you want to say later. Senya, you've grown stronger. Both physically and mentally. I'm not strong. Not at all. You have grown up. You are no longer the little girl that needs my protection. That is not true. I would not have made this far without Sis. So please, stay with me. Do not leave me alone ever again. Senya, you made it this far with your own strength. You have surprised me with your growth. You did a great job, Senya. Not true. I am nobody without Sis. Senya, you may not realize, but you have a stronger mind than I do. I'm not strong at all, sis. I'm not strong at all, sis. I've been watching you. You sure did surpass me. Simply looking at you, I can tell that you will never give up. Sis Magaleta, just open the door for us. Why are you saying all these last words? It's not like we are bidding farewell. Senya, 
You are strong and beautiful like a shining star. My one and only shining star. Sis, stop all this nonsense. Just open the door. Just come back to me. Sanya, I love you. You are the most important person to me. Sanya? I love you too, sis. That's it. Would you live on and stay alive for me? What? In that case, shouldn't you live on for me as well? I would, if I could. That is not fair, sis. Why? Why? Why are you giving up now? I'm sorry. The least I can do is keep... Is keeping my first promise to you. What? Wait. Oh wait, that was Magalada. The least I can do is keeping my first promise to you. What promise? It does not matter as long as Sis returns to church with me. Nothing else matters. I can't. There are so much more I would love to tell you. Tell me then, Sis. What's wrong? Open the door. It seems like I'm running out of time. Sis, no. Wait, Sis. I love you. Don't. Don't leave me. Farewell, Xenia. Magalena. No. Xenia never stopped knocking at the door. Never? That means she stayed there until she died? Even when the space is starting to fall apart. Even when Magalena has stopped responding long ago. Knocked and knocked till her hands are numb. Scream till her voice is gone. Xenia never stopped until everything disappeared. Oh, until everything disappeared. I had a feel. Nah, it ended like this. Wait, the producer is called Holy Priest? Huh? Oh, I guess that's just your name. The uh, username. <laughs> Cat word. So this is the credits. I had a feeling that the ending would be... Um, sad. The game seems to set itself as that from the beginning. Oh wait. Oh. I'm like, wait, is this game- was this in Chinese or Japanese? Because I recognize some of those characters as Japanese, then I'm like, oh wait, no, that's just the source, so yeah. I think the developer is Chinese. I wonder what ending this is. Is this ending number two or three? to bring sister back with me. There was so much I wanted to tell her. It took so much effort to finally meet met her. But I lost her again. At the end... Do not worry though. I have not given up yet. Sis must be waiting for me somewhere. This time, I'll do it right. We will definitely meet again. This time, I'll tell sis everything I wanted to say to her. Isn't she dead though? Or at least she disappeared, along with eternity. There's so much to talk about. I also want to hear Sis talk more about herself. Actually, I know Sis too well. I'm sure she will not want me to do this again. It is definitely not her wish for me to risk everything for her rescue. However, I do not care how long it will take. Even if I have to compromise with the power of eternity, even if I'll end up with a sorrow face of sis, I'm not stopping. This time, 
I will protect his Magaletta. Ending 3, Eternal Determination. Oh, here, this is the true ending. At least I think this is the true ending. Cause then the bonus room and whatnot. So the true ending is to not push her away. Hmm, I wanted to push it away. To push away, yeah. Well, I guess we can try, I see. Congratulations, you have completed Eternal Xenia. Please help us fill the questionnaire for the code to enter bonus room. No, how dare you do this to me. If you like the game, please help us spread the word out. You are more than welcome to stream this game. There's no better support than showing your gameplay. Holy Priest. Yeah, the game, the developer is called Holy Priest. I guess that's just the username. Like me, I call myself D mine. So yeah. Let's try get Andy 2. This time I'll do what I wanted to do. I feel bad because what I wanted to do results, I guess, in a worse ending. Because that is the true ending, I, I have to assume. Okay. Yep. Make sure you do not misclick D mine. Oh, actually, I think it's the first option. So, even if I do accidentally misclick, it will go straight to the one I wanted to do. Yeah, yes, what is she trying to do? What should I do? You should push her away. Ah, Xenia. What? Huh? Eternity has her. Xenia, wake up. I am not Nia. Huh? Senya? It was all my fault. I should not have taken Senya as a replacement for Nia. Ugh! Oh, what? She kills you! Senya slashed a sword at me. It is a bad wound, probably a lethal one, but it matters not. What matters is how bad I've wounded Senya with my actions. Senya? Yep, this is the worst ending. <laughs> I am sorry. Wait, I'm sorry. I've not been a good sister. Ugh. It was all my fault. Where was- Where was the root of this tragedy? I don't have the time nor space to figure that out. I just do my best limping towards Senya. Sis failed to protect you. Instead, I hurt you so bad. Oh. Senya waves his sword at me without even frowning. Looking at my wounds and this Senya, it is obvious to me now. All is lost. No more hope, no more light. Guess we cannot go back to the church together. My sight is blurred by tears. My voice started to choke. I need to apologize to you and to Nia. I failed to protect neither of you. It must have been a bad experience for you to have such a failure of sister like me. I am really sorry. Uh, ah! I will. I, we will. It is the last time I wipe my tears. It's the last decision I will make. For one last time. Senya. I want to tell Senya. This time, we are staying together forever. Damn, that ending! So what I wanted to do would result in me getting possessed by Eternity and then slashing her away. <laughs> and no, and killing my sister. Wow. That got dark. But yeah, I had a feeling none of the endings were gonna be a happy one. I had hoped though that one might be. Unfortunately not. So I think that's all the endings. Unless you want to check the bonus. Oh. Oh. Senya and Magaletta to Eternity. Ending number two. Wait. 
So, Margaletta is there all cut up bad, and then I'm sitting next to her? Oh, I guess Eternity left me and then you realize you killed your own sister. Ouch. Well, at least the third ending had a more hopeful one because you went searching for your sister, but... Alright. Let's see that... Um... Where is it? Oh no, that's not what I want to do. Let's check that bonus room. Alright. And we're back. So, basically I went, I went and replayed, the, redid the ending number 3 so I could see the website to fill in that questionnaire. I thought they gave, I thought they did it. So I went to the website and fill in the questionnaire. A shame though that I think it was region, that the questionnaire was region locked. So I couldn't access to it, so I had to use a proxy to to try and access it, which is kind of annoying, but it, anyway, I filled in the questionnaire and I got the code. So we can finally check out the bonus room, see what it's about. So it's 0130. It's recommended to keep a safe file before entering the bonus room. Alright, let's be on one. Enter bonus room now? Sure. Holy Priest. Welcome to the bonus room. Um, I don't know which one. Oh! Wait a second. That character behind the counter. Is that... Is that from Madoka Magica? <laughs> I am Holy Priest, author of Eternal Xenia. Thank you very much for playing, for taking the time and complete the questionnaire. Eternal Xenia is the first game that I independently developed. With the enthusiasm and love for gaming, I took on all the tasks from building this game, including design, coding, script, everything you see in the game. Well, of course you used the, some in-game assets, but yeah. I wonder if you all tried the beta version, the version when UI and artwork were not drawn by professionals. Oh. Eternal Xenia is like a child of mine. So whether you like the game or not, I sincerely thank you for playing Eternal Xenia. This bonus room contains my thoughts and notes during the development including the battle system design, character backgrounds, storyline, monsters, etc. If you are interested, please investigate the bookshelf. Last but not least, if you like the game, please post comments or discussions or, yeah, please post comments or discussions. Much appreciated. Yep. Alright. Well, I guess you can just take a look on the bonus room a little bit. Oh. All stats raised in Berserk phase also starts to split normal slimes on the battlefield. Senna stands no chance in fighting it head on. Though powerful Berserk King slime still has a rather simple pattern, it's not a hard fight if you have the pattern figured out. A challenging but not impossible first boss. Huh. Oh, okay, so we have a lot of details here. And like, we can find out. Why are you? Timberwolf. When working on this monster, I start to notice that some monster can use the scream sound when taking hits. So I picked a unique sound effect for Timberwolf. It is a dog whining sound. It is all these little details that build up the battle atmosphere. Alright. I wanna see what she has about Senya. Senya. Senya is a fragile teenager that lacks self-confidence. However, because of her faith to, to save Sister Magalata, Senya tried really hard to overcome many scary monsters and powers. Watching Senya work hard and struggle even gave me the strength to go through my looks. Not even the demon that gave her trauma can stop her. Even if she is attacked by her beloved sister, Senya never stopped marching forward. She is a character that I enjoyed very much building. I hope you all like her like I did. <laughs> Alright. So that is it for this episode and this playthrough. So yeah. I really liked the game, I mean it was a nice, touching little story, although I don't really sound like it, but that's just me. I don't really show my emotions when it comes to sad and touching stories, but inside I do feel it. The music was also nice, I don't know if it's their own music, 
or not, but the music in the game was good, and it fit the atmosphere for the most part. The game also looks alright, as far as RPG Maker games go. And it's also nice that the game is free on Steam, so there's literally no harm done. You can go and play it yourself, if you haven't already, and I'll even leave a link in the description. As for the gameplay, it was simple, nothing great or complex, but that was what the developer was going for, so I guess he or she accomplished it. So yeah, that's it. This has been D Mind, the mind of one and all. Let me know in the comments what you think and don't forget to leave a like and subscribe if you have enjoyed, and I hope to see you again next time.